Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations, the Office of Evaluation assesses programs and projects at global, regional, and national levels. These evaluations are part of FAO's endorsement of the UN Sustainable Development Goals dealing with poverty, hunger, gender, inequality, peace, and partnerships. In June of 2019, the German Ministry of Agriculture requested an evaluation of projects related to the voluntary guidelines on the responsible governance of tenure of land, fisheries, and forests in the context of national food security. An initial stakeholder workshop was held to gather outcomes and included representatives from countries that benefited from German-funded projects – Liberia, Mali, Mauritania, Mongolia, Senegal, Sierra Leone. In addition, representatives from other agencies were present. The workshop included outcome harvesting, which encouraged participants to express tangible results using simple terminology. Participants were asked about results obtained through projects funded by Germany. VGGT came to Mongolia in 2014, and the translation into Mongolian language took one year. For example, the word tenure we don't have in Mongolian language. And then we organized one whole day workshop just to describe this uh, tenure word into Mongolian. And at the end, finally, we agreed, uh, we agreed to, to use the word Edilbir. Now, this Edilbir meaning tenure word is using all over Mongolia. What we had to do to make this work successful is to work with the different traditional authorities, bringing them together. You notice that when you go to the north part of Sierra Leone, this is a purely male-dominated community, especially when we talk about land. What we did in the process was to bring the traditional authorities from the north to meet with those from the south, where you find female paramount chiefs. So learning from the south has also helped them to know that cross-feeding, where traditional authorities can say, if in the south, women can be paramount chief, there's something we can change to give us a women in the north leadership. Well, we support partners in civil society, partners in countries such as Liberia, such as Sierra Leone, to use those standards when it comes to policy processes in the countries and um, to the negotiation of new policies or new legislation within those countries. So one example would be the Liberia Land Rights Act that was um, adopted in 2018 and which is considered to be one of the most progressive across the continent. Um, and uh, there, the civil society working group on land reform in Liberia really used some principles from those guidelines to make it as progressive as it has come out finally. There was a project with more than 1,000 regularization foncières. There are five groups of women, five groups of women, qui ont été accompagnés dans le cadre de la régularisation foncière. Moi, je suis d'une commune rurale, la commune rurale de Fakala. Si, pour avoir une attestation de possession foncière, je l'ai à côté de moi dans mon village, pour avoir un titre foncier, je suis obligé d'aller à Bamako et ça va me coûter les yeux de la tête. Moi, je ne peux pas payer ça. Par contre, l'attestation, c'est une petite taxe que la mairie va mettre, je vais donner. Et ça, ça va aider. Si tout le monde prend, ça va aider les commissions foncières à fonctionner. Il n'y aura pas de problème. Les visites d'échange et d'expérience. Par exemple, que les Maliens viennent voir ce qui se passe de l'autre côté de la Mauritanie ou du Sénégal, ça permet de raffermir et de renforcer la solidarité et de voir aussi que les, dans les processus, par exemple, de formulation politique, il est possible de s'inspirer de ce que l'autre a pu réussir dans son pays. Enfin, par exemple, dans les lois, les plateformes ont réussi à influencer, en tout cas, les réformes et les directives volontaires ont été mentionnées dans les politiques foncières au Sénégal, mais aussi au Mali. The OED evaluation team is pleased with the outcomes and results and is looking forward to the next phase, in-country missions to verify key findings from German-funded projects. <laughs>